Welcome back to my channel. So I have today for you guys a big huge summer occasion war haul. I know a lot of you guys are asking for it so I thought I'd do, I'd film a really nice one for you guys. So without further ado, let's begin. So first off I have a ball gown of sequins. You guys know me, I have a massive sequin fetish. I hold my hands up, I love a sequin. <laughs> so when I saw this, it's a floor length pink sequin ball gown. I know. I know. It comes in the tall section and the petite section as well, so you can pick it up in either height. This is the normal, and I'm five foot four for reference. So this is it. And the best thing about it, I call this my Carrie Bradshaw outfit because I wore it with a pair of fluffy shoes. Oh, how amazing are these? I love them. If I could be a shoe just for like a day, this, this, I would be the shoe. It's so good. <laughs> so the dress is this lovely v-neck, really low, and then has this beautiful like hanging overlay. I don't know if you can see, which goes down into a long slit. So shows a bit of leg, but not too much, like a really nice kind of style. And I just love the fluffy shoes poking at the bottom. But if you wanted to do something a little less crazy, you could go for just a nude shoe or something like that. But when you're going out, why not do sequins and fluffy shoes? I mean, you only live once, right? I paired with it this white clutch. This is from ASOS's clutch. And it's one of those bags that goes with just absolutely anything and everything. So it's really handy to have in your wardrobe, especially in the summer, because a white clutch will, I think it would go with any, any outfit in this haul. So you can just pair it with so many different things. So, so super handy. And it's just really nice and elegant style with the little pearls on it as well. Overall, I just think this is the most fabulous outfit I've ever seen. And I, if I could, I would wear it all day, every day. Next up, we've got something completely opposite and we've gone for a very demure black kind of style. And it looks really, really normal. Normal. It has this v-neck here. I'd size down in this because it was a little bit big for my size But then we get to this bit and there's this epic like skirt like isn't that just amazing Like two magnets we are drawn to each other You just know how to push all my buttons Moved out of town and I erased your number But still I find myself you can see it's like netted material which is embroidered and then it has these little things poking out of it so beautiful material this was really incredible like when you walked if you want a statement dress if you want to walk into a room and everyone like turn their head and go wow then this is definitely the dress I paired it with new shoes because I didn't want anything to distract from the like beautiful detailing of the skirt at the bottom I've also paired it with this black Chloe dupe. This is from last year. I will try and find something similar or the same one somewhere. But it's so perfect, these little handlebags to pair of outfits, just something a little bit different, but so practical at the same time. If you guys have been with me for a while, you will know I'm an ex-ballerina, so this dress was just speaking to me on so many different levels. It's this Thule dress right here. So this is a tutu kind of fabric. It's called Thule, I believe. Getting good with my uh, names now. <laughs> um, it has this embroidered bodice, which is just the most beautiful design. Taking not a lesson learned Who'd imagined I would crash and burn But you got me there So I'm declaring I like the 
dainty straps on it as well so like it wasn't too heavy at the top and I loved how it like blended into the skirt so beautiful I believe they have these in different colors and different skirt lengths as well so you can really choose the style that suits you best I'll leave like a couple of options below bodice has extra like lining on the bust area but this is actually a little bit see-through so it's quite nice it has like the tutu lining as well on the inside so really nice effect I just paired it with new shoes because I didn't want to distract from this such a beautiful dress and I've just paired it with this very delicate pink clutch I mean how beautiful is this clutch if the dress couldn't be so pretty and beautiful I just added more beauty to it with this clutch it's absolutely stunning it has white little pearl detailing all over it and it's just the perfect size to like fit your phone your lippy in your keys and then go to the ball <laughs> I actually did feel like a princess in this dress <laughs> okay now this next one if you're looking for something a little bit quirky a little bit fun a mini dress but still quite evening kind of attire then this is for you <laughs> It's easy to speak out of the way I live But it's a 24 karat dream No supermodel in my dirty jeans But in my 24 inches heels Firstly, the colour. It's like a vibrant pinky orangey coral, I want to call it With big pink flowers on it yellow flowers it's just so vibrant so fun would be really nice with like a bright pink lipstick or a bright coral lipstick just to go with the the effect it has loads of ruffled layers on it but it's actually a mini dress so it stops here i just thought this was like a bundle of fun fun in a dress and if you wanted to have fun and dance and party and like this is just the cutest little dress i paired it with this top color ped raza bag and i have some studded shoes also in the colour top. I really went for muted accessories because the dress was so vibrant, but I think it works really well. Lastly, we have this like flamenco kind of style dress. So many ruffles, asymmetric, a bit of a train going on. It was just so fabulous. So it's this pink colour. I was re really feeling pink at the moment, guys. I like the colour pink. I hold my hands up because I used to say I didn't like it. But um, this is like an off pink, maybe like a nudie pink, I think. Coral. A muted coral. Let's go for that. <laughs> in London, drunk at night, in LA, picking fights. I think we have done it all. Asymmetrical, so I thought that was really fun. It had a bit of a bardo sleeve on one side as well, so lots going on, but it has a slit up one side and a massive train. Kind of flamenco, kind of Spanish, and the bag that I put with this, this gold ornate like circle bag, it was just so unusual and actually quite big. You could fit a lot of stuff in that. I think with evening wear and stuff like that, it's so fun to experiment and wear different things because it's a conversation starter as well. So you'll find the first thing that most people say to you is like oh my gosh where's your dress from where's your bag from like it's an easy icebreaker I find that anyway I just paired it with some lace-up heels nude again because there was so much going on with the dress I didn't want to distract from the beauty of the dress so I just went for a really simple nude court heel which laced up the leg which I thought went nicely with the slit so guys I hope you liked it I hope you can get some inspiration from it in some way if you're going to any upcoming events if you do please tag me I'd love to see if you get any of the outfits that I've tried on. All the shopping links will be in the description box below, so you just have to like do the drop down and they're all there, even the handbags and the shoes, everything's there. If you're new here, please do press subscribe. Join the family, it's growing. I'd love to have you here. <laughs> and my Instagram is at the Laura Blair. Come say hey over on there. And I will see you soon for another video. Bye. You got me dancing in a storm, burning everything we know. Dressing up as firefighters You got me dancing in your